for a very limited time only we have two new codes which you can use at mrmuckcoin.com which is the safest most reliable and quickest way to purchase your coins after checkout use code gs25 for 25 percent off of your order or use code gs40 for 40 percent more coins for example if you were to purchase 1 million coins and use code gs25 you would receive 25 percent off of that purchase or if you use code gs40 and purchased 1 million coins you would receive 400k extra for free link is in the description what up, what's going on, ladies and gentlemen? It's your boy, just welcome back to another Madden 19 video. Hopefully, you guys are doing fantastic. So, we are about to go on ahead and get into an online head to head games. I know what you guys may be thinking. Uh oh. Nelson done went ahead and went a few days without uploading. He's back to what it was before. Before you could even finish using every single team and, and they're dead, man. No, 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 listen. I had a 24 hour stream last Saturday. My sleep schedule is still out of whack. Still trying to recover from it. Still trying to go on ahead and, you know, uh, well, not even. It was like a week ago. Not even last Saturday. It was like two Saturdays ago. But my sleep schedule is still wild from it. But, you know, nonetheless, I apologize for the lack of uploads. It's just because my sleep schedule has just been awful. Like, my main channel has been suffering as well. But, you know, we're, we're going to get back on track, though. But as you guys can see, though, today we are using the Texans. And we match up against the Titans. And this right here was a very, very frustrating game. Uh, to say the least, because they, when I say they, I mean the Titans, have Deion Lewis, and Deion Lewis is a freaking phenomenal, and I mean phenomenal, spinner. And, you know, we're going through the Texans, right? And obviously, you know, first thing should come to mind, Jadavion Clowney, J.J. Watt, very good, you know, defensive pass rush, um, you know, Tyron Matthew, you know, good secondary. It's the offense that I might have trouble. I'm looking at the running backs. I'm looking at the wide receiver. DeAndre Hopkins, obviously a monster. But outside of him, there's not too many weapons for me offensively. And running the ball is going to be difficult. And uh, you guys know I run the ball, and I run the ball a lot. Maybe not in head-to-head -head <laughs> because, you know, uh, I need certain attributes in order for me to go ahead and run the ball consistently, which is, you know, spinning, which unfortunately they... They don't have, you know, um, they don't have in this game. But uh, there's not too many of them, you know. But anyways, nonetheless, we're going to start off on defense. We're going to start off with a little bit of 5-2. See if we can go ahead and create some havoc. And there he goes starting Deion Lewis over Derrick Henry. And you would figure most people would favor Henry, right? I had no idea that Deion Lewis had a good spin. Third and five right here, you know, hoping to go ahead and get ourselves something. He throws a beautiful pass over there. Quick post on the right side. And it's like, okay, okay, Mariota with a Doddington. Then right here, he's going to go ahead and face some pressure. He throws off his back foot. But thankfully, we go on ahead and we get ourselves a nice little stop right there. So we will gladly take that uh, right up the seams. And he ends up dropping the pass through the contact. And then very next play, tries to go to an out route. Does catch the pass, but is short of the first down. He's going to go ahead and no huddle. But we caught timeout. We, would, we did not like our defensive look. We went with hard flats, and thankfully we did because we stopped him just shy of the first down. Very first play, I'm not sure what he called, but we end up hitting a nice slant to the inside. And our first rushing attempt right here, trying to hit the outside, and we actually end up going absolutely nowhere. <laughs> Second and 11 right here, and we step up in the pocket. We're going to go ahead and slide down with Deshaun Watson, who has very, very, very good speed. And, you know, we definitely try to utilize that as much as possible. We get stopped shy of the first down. You guys know the rules, man. I try my best to have some fourth down swaggery so we can go on ahead and uh, have ourselves a nice uh, nice lead. You know, nice 3-0 nice lead right there. And hopefully, you know, a defense we can go on ahead and, you know, continue doing what it is we do, which is hopefully having some fun and getting ourselves a stop, right? Because we definitely want to go on ahead and get ourselves a stop. But then he starts running the ball, and he starts running the ball just amazingly, right? He really, really, really just just gives me a lot of trouble on the run. And in my opinion, it's such a big advantage, the fact that he got a, a running back where he can go on ahead, spin on us, and, you know, create a lot of havoc on the ground as Jadavion Clowney gets us a sack right there. Third and 27. He's going to need a miracle to get this first down. On the run, chucks off his back foot and almost, like, almost threw a dot. Almost, but thankfully it's an incomplete pass. And I was like, okay, we get ball at the half, right? We also go on ahead. We have ball here. 3-0 lead. 
Let's play smart. Don't do anything dumb, and we should be okay. Even though we are kind of pinned close to the end zone, but we are going to go on ahead and uh, take off with Watson, and then we try rushing on the right side. But again, no ball carrier moves. I, I can't get by anyone uh, unless it's a juke. You know, juking and head to head, like almost everyone can juke. And right there, I was just about to throw it to X, who created some space. But unfortunately, we end up getting sacked. So uh, right here, we roll out to the right side. And this time, he covered it. But Deshaun Watson is going to go ahead and take off. We're going to slide down and get ourselves a huge gain. And then third and 10. Let's see if we can keep the first down going. We go over there to the left side. That's exactly what it is we do with a hot one over there to the left side. And I was like, okay, let's see if we can get in field goal range. We dump down underneath right here. Lamar Miller, 17 seconds remaining. We're just going to go on ahead and uh, get stopped on the 28-yard line. So, first and 10, two timeouts remaining. And again, Deshaun Watson doing what Deshaun Watson does. Pick up that block right there. Pick it up. And he does it. And we just get forced out of bounds. There's enough time for maybe one play. We rush to the outside right here. And swing. About the only um, productive move any ball carry has in his game, which is which is the juke. A lot of people can juke. But, um doesn't work all the time. <clears throat> but thankfully there, it did, right? We end up scoring 10-0, and we get ball at the half. Now we fill in full control, right? Because we want to take Deion Lewis out of the game. Because I know he can just create a lot of havoc. And if I could force him to pass the ball, then he's going to have to go on ahead. And we start off with a great return. Then he's going to have to go on ahead and face, you know, Clowney, face J.J. Watt. And that's what we want, right? We want to go on ahead and have our monstrous pass rushers knowing he's going to pass the ball Pin the ears back and hopefully create some havoc. So right here, we, we had B wide open. I don't know why I panicked right there and tried to take off. A, a loss of uh, huge yards right here. We take off with Watson. Thankfully, we didn't fumble right there. That right there was not the smartest thing to do right there. Um, third and 12, and we go underneath, and he ends up dropping it. And unfortunately, we got to go ahead and punt the ball. But, you know, we wasted half of the, the quarter right there. And, uh, you know, hopefully we can, you know, and we pinned him under one yard line as well. Hopefully, we can just, you know, play some good defense. He actually just does a comeback route right there. And he actually ends up, uh, you know, getting himself a few yards. And right here, you see that spin move is just, it's, it's, it's hellacious. It's devastating. It is. It is. And I'm jealous whenever I face someone that can spin and, and, and I can't. Like, I'm, genu I'm generally just jealous. But thankfully, we end up coming away with the huge dive tackle. Nipped at the ankles because that right there almost got ugly. So, he goes on ahead. He no huddles. He's going to go out and pass the ball. Now, I'm prepared for the run, right? Because he's running the ball so much where I got to try and stop the run, right? So now, as usual, when someone runs, 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 and having a ton of success on me, I got to go ahead and settle out three, four, you know, try my best to stop the run because, swing that spin move right there. He's killing me with it. He's absolutely, positively destroying me with it. And we got to make something happen right here because we can't continue to just give up big yardage to Deion Lewis and then... You know, he's just going to be able to, you know, mix in the, the run, mix in the pass. And, like, that's that's last, that's worst-case scenario. When I have someone running effectively, passing effectively, it's like, what do I defend? I don't know what to defend, so I'm having trouble. And he just had a beautiful drive, an absolute beautiful drive. And it all comes down to me having to stop Deion Lewis, who is just ferocious right now. He's, he's killing me. It's like, all right, let's see if we can run the ball. Nice cut-up field right here. Huge, huge, huge gain. By Lamar Miller, let's at least get in field goal range here. Or, you know, we don't even have to really um, we don't even have to really uh, win by getting in scoring range. You know, we can just hold on to the ball for as long as possible, and we'll be good. You know, like, we can win the game without him touching the ball. Two-minute warning, third and three, toss to the outside. We pick up the first down. We stay in bounds. Go on ahead and uh, chew more clock right here, and then I go on ahead and I pause the game because we got to go on ahead and we got to take a look-see. And we got to see who has, well, not not my uh, my QB, who has good speed besides Miller because Miller's tired. I need someone else in here besides Miller because he's tired. Is there anyone else? And there is. And I also want a truck too. So we look and our trucking back is uh, Foreman because I wanted to go right up the middle and we didn't get anything but a gain of two. Very next play, we hit the outside and we actually lose two yards. And then right here on third and ten, we're going to go for it. I just want a few yards so I can take my three. And that's exactly what it is we get. We get ourselves a handful of yards. We're going to go on ahead, take our three points, and, you know, see if we can lock up and get this W on defense. Even though I'm, I'm, I'm shook. I'm shook. But you would figure, no timeouts, 57 seconds remaining. You would figure he's going to, you know, not run the ball 
and not have me worry about Deion Lewis because he's 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 destroying me every time he rushes to the outside, spin moves. I, I'm having trouble stopping the young man. So hopefully we take Deion Lewis out of the game, force him to pass the ball, and then we can go on ahead and play the pass heavily, which we did right there. Big sack by Clowney, and I also put pass rush on aggressive right here. He just chucks it up because the pressure was about to get there, and we come away with the interception and we end up winning the game. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the video, man. We're gonna go ahead and take some knees and get up out of here. Um, we, uh, again, end up winning the game and, and I had to take a look at Deion Lewis and, and then I, I seen that he had an 88 spin. It's like, okay, I have yet to use the Titans. So whenever I do use the Titans, I know who my starting running back is going to be. It's going to be Lewis because he was killing me with the spin. But thankfully, you know, um, we got in field goal range, took all of his timeouts, forced them to pass the ball. Didn't have to worry about the run whatsoever. And it made it a little easier to be able to utilize your Davion Clowney and JJ Watt when I knew for sure they had to pass the ball. So, you know, one streak of four. You know, getting our, our wins back up there. Our record is, what, 23-6 and six or something like that. Um, not the best record. I really feel like only one game, well, two games, we got blown out. Um, the other four were winnable. I really feel like we could easily be 27-2, and two, but unfortunately, we're not. But anyways, man, hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. Let me know what team you guys want to see next. We haven't played with the Browns, Buccaneers, Cardinals, Chargers, uh, Jets, and Titans, Raiders. Redskins. I haven't played with any of those teams yet. Let me know which one you guys want to see next. Until next time. Peace!